Good morning. I'm excited to start a day with you guys. I don't really know what this vlog is gonna be. I'm trying to decide if it should be edited or not. Like an unedited. Do you guys, whoa, sorry. I really don't have a shirt on right now. So that is why I'm doing this with the blanket. But do you guys want an unedited vlog soon? I think I'm gonna edit this one because I just want to. Girl, can my shoulders stay covered? It's 8.30 right now. I woke up at like 8. I've been just lounging around. The sun is out, but it's super windy out today. I honestly might go to the gym just to walk on the treadmill because I'm going to Pilates later. I don't want to like overdo it. I just don't really... No, I should walk outside. I should walk outside. Let me get over myself real quick. <sighs> Today's gonna be fun, babes. We're gonna make it fun. Make sure to click that subscribe button down below. It helps me so much. And you can join in on my life that I broadcast every single week for you guys. We're gonna be here till I am 80 years old doing God knows what. I'm gonna be vlogging, so subscribe. You don't wanna miss out on that. 80 year old me. You don't wanna miss out on that. I don't think. I have my Apple Watch on. Which I hate. I think Apple Watches are so ugly. But I'm going to start using it again. If you've never used a tongue scraper, get one right the f*** now. I'll literally link it in the description of this video. Because it is... You'll never know you needed it until you use it. It scrapes up all the bad bacteria on your tongue. It just leaves it feeling really fresh. And I'm obsessed with it. And you're not going to watch me do it because it's f***ing disgusting. Kisses. See you later. I'm gonna do the task that's gonna take me the longest, the biggest, chunkiest part of my day that I have to get done with is gonna get done first, which is editing a TikTok. So I'm gonna do that on my computer after I eat my breakfast. Maybe I'll watch a little YouTube before I start getting my work done today. Mmm, eating my oats, taking my vitamins. <sighs> take yours, they're really fucking good for you. We cannot get all of our nutrients from food in America, so take your supplements. I wanna go to Europe, I wanna go to Europe so fucking bad just to eat the food. No, for so many reasons, but I just wanna experience what real food tastes like. What does natural real food taste like? I have no idea because I've never been to a place like that. I took 73 videos yesterday. Jesus Christ. I need to pipe it the fuck down. All right, time to edit. I got the video edited and then now I just have to do a voiceover for TikTok. Make sure to follow me on there because my content has been a fucking one. Like I have been stepping it up and making sure that my content is really easy to watch. Quick pace, yet I'm really explaining myself while still keeping your attention span. Because I like to make content that I like to watch. And personally, I like to watch stuff that is really fast paced, but still gives you meaning, you know? And that's what I'm trying to do here. So let me know if I'm achieving that. Go follow me on TikTok, Brooke Mooney underscore. But this package I just got in the mail. I gotta show you everything right now because I'm thrilled. I literally have to try everything on the second I get it. Does that happen to anyone else? You literally have to try on the clothes that you get in the mail the second they come in the door because you're so excited about them if you're not like that you need to start better slow your roll you need to start ordering better clothes hey oh my god before i get into this let's pretend my fucking ugly ass apple watch is not on i'm on a fitness journey okay but i do want to let you know you can use my code brooke for 15 percent off everything that i'm about to show you i'm about to show you all of their clothes but white box also does offer a swimmer line and an activewear line which i own pretty much every week they sell afterpay is available for all us new zealand and australian customers which is great and don't forget there is express worldwide shipping this fucking dress you guys oh my god this fits like a glove i've never had a little silk dress fit me so well first of all it's the perfect length i hate when they're a little too long this isn't too short not too long perfect medium second of all it's making the girls look really nice and i love the lace little flowers right here the color is just beautiful and now for the main event these cowboy boots you guys oh my god i've been wanting cowboy boots for so long 
and I haven't been able to find the right pair so obviously I had to get these they're so comfy I love that the heel is minimal not too big it just gives me a little bit of height yet I'm still comfy they're the perfect length for my knees like they literally end at the perfect spot and to flare it up look at these cute little bedazzled straps on them and then I got these boots in black I love the minimal detailing on them they're clearly a cowboy boot but they're not too in your face they can go with pretty much anything you guys I'm gonna have to get this dress shortened a little bit because I'm a short girl but that's totally fine I'm used to that oh my god I feel like I need to be at Coachella in this because I feel like Coachella has turned into like I feel like for the like 2016 to like 2019 era it was like go absolutely f berserk and look insane and now it's like the really cute festival vibes but don't overdo it so i feel like this would be so good like a little cute day three outfit when you're like over it even though i've never been hopefully next year but i'm really happy to have this because obviously it looks amazing together but these two pieces can be worn separately so well booty says hello in the skirt like this with a little tan oh i'm sorry i'm wearing this every day of my life first of all feels like I'm naked. The material is so comfortable. Do you see what I'm talking about here? Second of all, do you see what this is doing for the bod right now? We are snatched. This is the length dress that I like. Pretty short, but it looks so good. We have this adjustable tie back. A little halter dress. The little flare at the bottom. So comfortable. Can't express enough how comfortable this is. The material kind of like ruffles up right here, which if you watch me, you know I love that. Oh, this is my new favorite dress, you guys. I can't get, I literally cannot get over it. Literally will never get over this. This is kind of crazy. Probably something I would only wear to like a festival. The top, the skirt, babe, I'm gonna slay in this all freaking summer long. So let's start off with the skirt moment. We have this little tie action going on. We have pockets. You can wear this in a million different ways. So I'm really happy to have this in my wardrobe. And then this top is so cool. So it's a butterfly. This is how it ties in the back. It has one, two ties in the back and then a tie up top in the front. I feel like I would wear this to like Coachella, you know, but Coachella's over. Actually, it's gonna be day three weekend two when this goes up, so pretty relevant to the times. Honestly, this top is a lot more flattering than I expected it to be. I really like this. Okay, hold the phone. Hold the phone. This is even cuter. Oh my god, this looks so cute together. I'm wearing this exact outfit to go ball if I go. If it's not too hot, because I will sweat my ass off in this skirt. But this shirt, oh my god, I'm even more obsessed. Up close is a butterfly. From afar, you're not really sure. You want to get to know what it is. You're intrigued. You know what I'm saying? And here it has the same back. Oh my god, guys. This fit, this whole fit together, I'm f***ing deceased. This is the step up in fashion that we need. We need this step up. We can't be just doing jean shorts and a cute top anymore we need to go off we need a skirt moment if you feel a little bit uncomfortable that means you're doing something right that means you're stepping out of the box and being different okay that's what i've noticed every time i look in the mirror and i'm like this is really cute i feel good in it but like i don't know you know it's a little too much that's when you know you're doing it that's when you're doing it if you're a little bit uncomfortable but you still have to be able to like slay in it you know what i mean like i would still slay in this because if you can't feel fully confident in it and move confidently in it then the clothes are going to wear you and you're not going to wear the clothes i am ready to shake it this is so Okay, so I thought this top was a must because who doesn't need a white corset with a little flare, you know? And these jeans, bro, first of all, they're the perfect length low rise. They're not too low. The color is so cute and I mean the pockets, come on. We got the little extra oomph there. Here's what they look like up close. I used to have shorts like this and I was obsessed with them. I need to show you just the way that these pants fit. They are a really, really nice fit. They're baggy, but not too baggy. I love the way they bunch up on the bottom. I love like everything here just, just makes sense. They fit right. You know, I'll tell you something that I like about this. I'm not making noise everywhere I go. I can move and these things aren't clinking together because that shit annoys me. Like I can't be walking around making noise. So I can slay in silence. Okay, so I wouldn't necessarily pair these together but I don't have anything else to show you with this bolero is everything I love that it goes over the neck and comes across the chest I think this would be really cute under like a short sleeve shirt that maybe you want a little extra flare so you throw this on underneath or you just wear it with a tight top like this but not this one because it is sticking to these and it's kind of pulling on it but yeah I just wanted to show you this again wouldn't necessarily wear these together I need to take it off because I'm gonna literally rip it but it's little things like these that really elevate your looks. 
Like, yeah, you might have the cute jeans and the cute shirt, but like, we've seen that outfit before. You throw this on and it's something different and people remember it, you know? Again, I wouldn't necessarily wear this top with these pants, but how cute are they? Oh my god, I love them. You guys need these, they're so fun. It looks like paint on the pants. So cute, Paul is gonna love these. Okay, these pants are dope. The pockets are everything. They're actual real pockets too. And they have them on the butt too. What a cute, cute idea. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six pockets all together. And they all slay in their own ways. And then for this top, I love a good mesh top. You guys know I love a sleeve that goes over the hand. One of my favorite looks. It just says white fox kind of all over it in different fonts. This is also a really good transitional piece because it is long sleeve, but it is mesh. So it's very breathable and obviously white pants are always the best transitional piece because they're bright They're spring vibes, but they're also pants so they keep you warm when you need it, you know Thanks for opening my mail with me. Okay, make sure to use code Brooke for 15% off white fox The link is in the description. It is the perfect spot to shop spring summer looks What the heck? What is this guy doing here? I was just filming a voiceover. I'm literally about to say like my last word. This guy just walks in. Hello. And guess what? What? I have something for you. I got it for you yesterday. Oh. Hand soap that you love. And that body, body soap. Eye? And it smells so good. Give it a whiff. Mmm. I love it. It's like vacation. What are you doing here? Making sure you were cheating on me. <gasps> I'm sitting here looking at screens all day. <laughs> hi, baby. Hi, baby. What's up? I wanted to say hi. Oh, guys, I love him so much. <laughs> I love this man. All right, I'm gonna go make lunch and Paul's gonna leave. Mwah. Guys, this tree is so beautiful. It's like brightening up this whole area. Camera's, of course, never gonna do it justice, but like in real life, it's so bright and so beautiful. You guys, I forgot my camera downstairs and there's no way that I'm going to get it. Oh, hi. Um, Cause I wanna devour this. I don't even know what I just made, but it's gonna be good. And I'm gonna watch some YouTube. Oh, hey Lauren. And then I'm gonna actually finish my video because I got so distracted when Paul came over. Now it's time to get down to it. Here you are, just came to pick up my camera downstairs. And we're making our way back up. Oh, gotta pick up the clean clothes and make our way back up. That gets my legs every time, man. So the voiceover is filmed now. Whew. Time to edit the voiceover. And then I really need to paint my damn toes because they're not looking good right now. You guys are never gonna believe this. My mom starts screaming my name. I'm like, what the f is going on? Shoot, it wasn't that dramatic at all. She just was calling for me. <laughs> and she comes upstairs with this. And she goes, I found these in the garbage. This is a part of my haul of the package that I just showed you guys. I fully threw this gorgeous top and these three pairs of sick ass sunglasses in the garbage. I'm very upset with myself, but thankfully my mom found them. So that was supposed to be part of the haul. Use code Brooke for 15% off White Fox. We'll get them next time. It's Pilates time. Maybe I'll film some of the class on my phone. sugar I'm gonna die so I got one and it's so good but now I need to clean my mat because I have a cork mat and this one smells like ass because for some reason so my sister and Molly have the same exact mat but with no design on it and their mats never smell like it's marketed as the kind of mat that doesn't smell like it has all these benefits and I'm getting none of them but apparently the brand said that it smells because of the ink of the design and they're like just let it sit in the sun like clean it I do everything that they say I've let it sit in the sun for like 12 hours and nothing 
unfortunately. I tried to get them to send me a new one, but they wouldn't. I'm just gonna have to buy a new one because it started smelling like after a few times of using it. Oh my god, ew, that's my sweat. Okay, so I've decided that I'm gonna put my phone down for the rest of the night. Not exactly turn it off because I'm addicted, but just like keep it upstairs when I go downstairs. Not spend all my motherfucking time on it because I can't get off. Um, I need socks because my feetsies are coldy. I didn't eat dinner yet and it is 7.28. I just changed the face of my Apple Watch because I'm a big watch girl now. And I usually eat at like 6, period, but I was a little full from my smoothie, so I'm going to go figure out something to eat downstairs. Bitches! I'm kidding. You're all perfect angels. I just got a boost of energy. I got everything on my to-do list done today besides painting my toes. I'm not letting myself off easy, babe. I'm doing that tonight. I don't care. I was little. I was a little kid. And his older brother was in the sixth grade. And his older brother was instigating me. And the kid was punching me, punching me. I wasn't really fighting back. And then I just like got broken up. And then I went home. The next day I had two black eyes. Oh. But don't think I didn't get him back. <laughs> yes. I beat his ass. And rock away beach. Rock, 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 rock away beach. Guys, the Knicks are in the playoffs. Game two. They won the first one. Time for our favorite show ever. <sighs> Let me turn off this basketball talk that not everyone gives a shit about. I love that show. It's so good. It is like the trash TV that you need. It's the drama that you're not involved in but you want to watch. Especially between people that you have nothing to do with. They don't even know you exist. That's everything. I swear it's healthy for the brain to just observe these kind of irrational blowouts. Mm, they're not all irrational. I shouldn't even use that word. Where the f*** is my tret knowing? I love Real Housewives in New Jersey. I've been watching it for years, probably since I want to go with like 2014. Yeah, me and my family love it. Dolores is my favorite. She is the best. You can't tell me otherwise. Guys, can you please comment down below what kind of videos you want to see from me? Do we want like a sit down video vibe where I like go in my car and we get deep? Do you want another vlog? I'm going to the Yankee game on Thursday. Maybe I'll vlog that and that'll be my next video. But just let me know. Are you a vlog girl or are you a sit down girl where I like answer your questions? I think I want to do a sit down video soon and just chat and have some girl talk and you can ask me any questions that you want so follow me on instagram that was the wrong i just put lash serum on my brows grande lash it's the best use code brook mooney 15 or underscore i'm not even sure i think it's 15 try either or i don't know what to tell you lol but yeah follow me on instagram because that's where i'll ask all the questions for any video that i do if i do a starbucks video if i do a question video and i'm just keeping you guys updated throughout the entire day on my instagram stories i'm an instagram girl i love you guys so much i'm gonna read my book Comment your favorite self-help books in the comments down below because I've been really into those recently. Me, read one. I've been really into all of that kind of stuff lately. I literally am rereading the same one that I've read in the past. But, still comment. I want you to know, genuinely, truly, honestly, that I love you. And I'm talking to you watching this right now. Look at this screen right now. I want you to know that I love you you the one watching this with your own eyes a lot of times when people talk to the camera on youtube i don't for some reason think that they're talking to me but i want you to know i'm talking to you if nobody told you today you're an amazing person and i love you so much good night i'm gonna go to sleep and wake up tomorrow and edit this enjoy the rest of your sunday Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I post YouTube videos every week, but if you want more of me, you can follow me on Instagram, TikTok, and Twitter. My username is at brookmooney underscore. My sister, my dad, and I also have a podcast called It's a Mooney Thing. If you guys watched up until this point, comment this emoji in the comments down below. And here is today's subscriber shout out. I love you so much and I'm so thankful for you. Make sure to like and subscribe. It's a free way to help me out. All right, peace. Peace out, guys. Love you.